Uh, welcome to The Long Journey Home. It's a space sci-fi game which combines an open world full of galaxies, planets and anomalies with quest mechanics of a roguelike RPG with the procedural, I believe, procedural generation of the universe and the game map. The game is developed by Daedalic Studio West. Um, I'm Oni Stuffs, an avid video gamer and less player. I've been interested in video games since childhood and since 2010 I've been regularly making YouTube videos and since 2014 I've been streaming regularly. I tend to show a very casual and friendly enthusiastic atmosphere in my live stream. Uh, the event we have is the Game and Trend Mixer Online, a peer learning exchange program for game developers and game design students organized by Geoth Institute and Steve Learning Digital Sphere Culture. And the Geoth Institute, Maxim Lerbhavon, is the Federal Republic of Germany's cultural institute active worldwide to promote the study of German abroad and encourage international cultural exchange. All right. Today's game is The Long Journey Home. It is, well, <laughs> it's a game on with procedural generation, randomly generated galaxies, with um, where the first um, hyperspace-enabled spaceship of humanity uh, accidentally ends up way further than they intended to go and now they are trying to go through the long journey to return home. So let's begin and uh, before we as we also begin we're going to uh, we're going to mention the winner of the previous stream from the Nikila so you know uh, stick around uh, I will soon display the three questions that you need to answer to get your chance of getting a lucky draw or something like that to potentially win a something something cool things anyway um let's get back on track let's quickly begin because yes the game is i believe strongest at the start it has the strongest like appearance of at the start oh welcome to project daedalus i know my head is kind of like blocking the thing let me just move it out of the way there we go Welcome to Project Dale as maiden flight of humanity's first jump capable ship. So here we first select four crew members. We got uh, Sarah Van Hartigan, archaeologist. We got Malcolm, test pilot. Alexandra, uh, engineer. Ash, a botanist. Benoit, theoretical physicist. Kirsten, astronaut. Nicolay, uh, researcher. Miriam, mission planner. Uh, Simon, corporate executive. And Zoe, uh, a civilian observer. So, yep. Yeah. Each of them has like different storylines based on the games, so obviously you need to do multiple runs to get all of their storylines. Let's just start with something that would be appropriate for a mission like this. So we'll get the test pilot, we'll get the engineer, we'll get the astronaut, and I suppose a mission planner would be good. Alright, there we go. Boom. Uh, let's begin. Let's choose the ship. We have three ships. We have ISIS Discovery, ISIS Ulysses, and ISIS Endurance. Uh, they all have different stats and different capabilities. We're just gonna go with the Something with like a, Like more or less average settings. So Ulysses I believe is the one with the average settings. Yeah, more or less average numbers here So we'll just choose that Got to choose our lander. So we got three landers ISV Odyssey, ISV Serenity and ISV Pathfinder again the same kind of um, different like stats and values we're gonna go with the average of the bunch so we go with isv serenity and we can make like we can write seeds here to for the galaxy generation or we could just uh, click start and have a random seed happen but as we're going to click start we're going to actually um oh sorry i got something okay. we're going to actually display our first question i think hold on a second what is the first question i completely forgot oh boop there you go hopefully you pay it attention to the start <laughs> oh i need to also disable that sorry <laughs> boom let's go okay so we got a uh, story mode we can we can change this we can start from arthur start after the jump again like i said i believe the strongest part of the game is the starting so we're gonna go start from earth learn how to pilot the ship uh, launch from earth fuel up on mars embark on humanity first jump to alpha centauri let's go 10 9 ignition sequence start 6 5 4 3 2 1 
And these cutscenes are amazing. Alright. Okay, so we need to brief stop on Mars so we can check the map here. That's us it's orbiting the Earth there. We need to go to Mars, so let's get moving. Let's boost so we can quickly head out. And let's slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. Gosh dang it. I. I the spaceship controls always give me so much issue. Alright, come on, come on, slowly, 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 we can do it. Come on, we can do it, we can do it, it's not that difficult. Come on, there we go, 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 slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. There we go, come on. And orbit. Okay, cool. We've managed to orbit. Uh, let's go to land. Because we need to visit the shape early mining colony to get exotic matter for the junk. Slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. Don't, don't cross the or orbit line, please. Okay, now, now, slow down, slow, 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 slow. Hmm. I always have difficulty with the lander controls. There you go. All right. Uh, we reached the location. Let's go here. Let's go to calm. Wait, no. Wait, I am here. What are you talking about? Oh, visit. Sorry. <laughs> All right. Uh, welcome to Mars. Uh, give us our big EM tank. Thank you. Ooh, we got another present. We also get a prototype shield generator. Very nice. Oh, if only they existed in real life. <laughs> All right. Let's go. Return to orbit, put the antimatter in the star drive, and install that shield. Let's go. Shield was refueled in orbit. Very nice. Alright. So let's go to ship. Uh, go to lab. Lab, we need to choose someone who's the best one to do it. Give it to your friendly neighborhood Grace Monkey. Well, you're the you're the uh, engineer, so you can go ahead and do that. All right, let's get our sh shielding. What's our shielding? Oh, you you just installed the shield. Okay. Uh, next, we need to go to our resources, I believe. No? Yeah, there we go. Wait, how do you get the resources? Got them. Ah, these are okay. Ship, go to laboratory. Oh, EM tank, right. Go to e EM tank. All right. Sure. Why, why don't you do it? There we go. That should be enough for three jumps. Excellent. All right. Hold thrust and boost to activate the jump drive. Let's thrust and boost. I'm sure nothing can possibly go wrong. Hmm, something went wrong. <laughs> Something went very wrong. Oh! Oh no, someone has a concussion. Alright, space folder malfunction. Where are we? This isn't Alpha Centauri. Sensory sensors indicate something large in the debris field is trapping here. 
Okay. So. Come on, come on, come on, move. Okay, so we are heading towards the direction of this arrow. Be careful of the debris field. Uh, one thing is weird about like when you're in the spaceship orbit view, um, it actually obeys like Newtonian physics in that like if you speed along some direction, there's nothing to slow you down. There is no friction. Uh, sorry, not Newtonian physics. There's no friction. But here there is friction in this view, which is, which gets me kind of weirded out, but whatever. All right. Uh, turn this way. Very nice. Okay. Also, while we're at it, let me actually change the question around. Do, 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 do. Hopefully you paid attention to... <laughs> Alright, there's something here. That's definitely spoopy. Very spoopy. Very spoopy indeed. Come on, come on. Move. Come on, duck and weave. Duck and weave. Thread that needle. Something large in the debris field is trapping us here. Hello, large debris field. What are you doing? Some sort of giant space magnet. Alright, Kirsten's out there entering the alien structure. Good luck. Don't freak out. I'm sure you won't freak out. You have like six missions or something under your belt. Alright. Waiting exploration. Everything built to a much bigger than human scale, so they were taller. Much of it's rusted over. In space? Rust in space. Okay then. Giant glass capacitor crackle with trap lightning. Okay, no sign of life present. Soup sensor is ozone nitrogen few unidentified. Found a door. Power seems to be on. What signal should we send? Uh, I don't know. Computer terminal here. Translating everything I say into symbols. Looks like compatible with our technology. It's a translation matrix. It's gonna help us talk to you, talk to aliens. All right. Doors curling open. Flower made of aluminum. Now that reminds me of that scene from um, uh, District Nine. Walking through it, endless tunnels leading in every direction. Soft blue lights heading into some sort of control center. There's a cradle in the middle of the room, attached to the ceiling by wires. There's something inside it. A glowing cylinder. I can't explain it, but it calls to me. All right. Take the keystone. Should be able to break it free with the plasma torch. The hum in the air is gone. The spheres shutting down around me. Returning to the ship while I can. Oh yeah, that's probably better. Don't get don't get stuck in there. Spears hold on us is gone. We can leave this space graveyard whenever we like. Okay. Don't crash into something while we charge. They'll be good. Excellent. Okay. So we're done here. There is something over that way. I think we'll head to that section because there's something something weird there. What's happening over there? Now slow down. Prepare to slow down. Prepare to slow down. Slow down. We need to make contact. We need to make contact. There you go. Interception. All right. Already got alien interception. Very nice. Cool music. All right. That's a call. Reeve drone. It's a reeve. Weapons off. Shields off. Reeve drone. Message playback starting. Continue. This, the red button. Press the red button, fella. That's it. Recording. You show this time? Right. Let me do the message this time. Hey there, friends, if you're here. Sorry, I need to do the voice. Hey there, friends, if you're hearing this, that's a bunch of us Reeve trapped down on that planet. Not a whole lot of food left. What is less drinkable than hoped? Would likely appreciate and assist if you're swinging past. Okay, now which button turns this thing? Uh, recent coordinates. Yes, survival chance 67%. Oh, wow. Okay, wh where is that? Safe Haven Beta Eridani. Uh, received a message from a nearby planet about a colony help. Uh, yeah. Alright, sure. Ab absolutely, we'll help. So, we need to alien transmission. This is, they sound like places for trading. So. Real for metals on nearby planets also. So, that's cool. Okay. Alright, so where are we getting going? Ooh, that planet? Is that the planet we're heading? What is that planet? 
Slow down. Slow down. Slow down. Be careful. It's quite interesting. Like, I've never done like any sort of like space flight simulator games before, so this is definitely some a new experience. I, I, I quite like it. Slow down. Slow the hell down. Slow the hell down. Come on, we can dock. We can dock. Got him. All right. Harmless planet. Mostly um, hydrogen. All right, let's go land and let's try to get something cool in here. Let's try to grab some hydrogen while we can. Also show you the lander stuff. Lander stuff. That's a word. All right, come on. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. We're going so fast. Stop, 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 Hmm. This is the one thing about landers I just I really dislike is that when you come in, there is no stopping. No matter how much you boost, uh, you will crash. Slow, 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 slow down, 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 please slow down. Please, please slow down. Thank you. Okay. Be careful. Okay, good. Very slowly. Come on. We need to slowly hop. 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 Slowly hop. 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 We now consider what I don't know what what I don't e I, I don't don't even know what those like reef guys is wanted. Oh did were we supposed to go like immediately rather than like wait? Oh I thought okay. Alright, I didn't realize that. It's kinda sad, but alright. Alright. Come on. Stop stop it. Okay, fine. We'll flip up. We'll fly upside down. Let's go. Let's go. Alright, gone. We do want to go like help the aliens, but kinda wanna figure out like how this is going. Alright. Okay. So let's uh, go here. Let's enable our last question. All right. Okay. Should be an easy question. All right. So we need to go where? I, I suppose we'll start our immediate thing and let's see where the guys need help, the planetary alert. Okay. All right. Where is the planetary alert? Oh, there? Is that the place? Yeah, that's the place. So we need to head that way. Okay. So we need to make like the farthest jumps as we can. That's a yellow dwarf. Hydrogen fluorine. Uh, that's iron, aluminum, copper. We just got hydrogen. So we're good on that front. Uh, where? Where is this? No, 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 no. Um, that's that way. That's that way. Okay, so we do need to head that way. So let's let's go. All right, let's head that way. Okay. Show me the map. Uh, we'll try to go to the that like that asteroid belt because asteroid belts are good resources. There are more spaceships here but i kind of want to go to that asteroid belt come on turn and up turn and up there we go now we're boosting towards that asteroid belt come on now slow down slow down slow down slow down okay there we go we're heading towards the asteroid belt gravity well there we go we can just smash into it so it just opens the there you go do 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 all right a lot of cool shot cool, cool stuff here sorry uh, we need to activate our weapons on this one. Because we need to shoot down a asteroids. Oh my god! Okay, that's a huge one. That's a very large one. Okay, very slowly, very carefully. These are a bit dangerous because if you hit into them, you take damage. And with, with obviously, I mean, it's an asteroid. 
you hit into it, you can't die. Okay, so this is one of those uh, cool looking asteroids. Alright, come on, let's... There we go. Now we can collect our loot. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, we need to duck and weave, we need to duck and weave. Come on. Uh, really, really, really. Really, really, they all like decided to crash into that one. <sighs> I can't even get to that loot anymore. That yellow uh, bright thing because it's just being compressed between. Wait a second, they can they can come to me. Hold on, hold on. Very carefully, very carefully. The... There we go. Okay, we found one platinum. All right. Let's keep going. Let's let's ignore that. Yes, I'm aware. I'm not leaving right now. We need. We have still two more things to go. Um, we want to go this way first because that appears to be closer. Right, come on. Ah, there we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Let's actually blast it from this distance so we can. There we go. So by the time we reach it, it's probably should have something good. Slow down, slow down, right? You can't slow down in this one because you auto slow down. That is so, that is so weird. Okay, uh, we found a copper. That's great. Let's grab this one. Slowly. Okay, good. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Now move towards that last one. Okay, be careful. These should be exploding bits. Okay, be careful, be careful. Be careful, you don't control slow deceleration. Okay, excellent. <sighs> Alright, let's go. Be careful, be careful, don't smash into things. Do not smash into things, that's a lot of things to smash into. How about we don't, don't go there. Alright, come on. Come on. Wow, this is quite far away. Wow, this is quite far away. This one, come on. I've came all this way, I'm not leaving without- Ah, there we go, there we go, you are coming our way. Excellent. Beautiful. Alright. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Grab that. Excellent. Anything else here? Doesn't look like it. Alright. Let's deactivate that and we can now charge through. Wonderful. Alright. We need to keep heading towards our destination. We can also try to make some... Oh, oh, we can try try to make contact. We can try to make contact. Guys, 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 guys. Guys, I want to make contact with you guys. Guys, I want to make contact. There we go. Make contact with more aliens. Yeah. Talk to all the... Oh, oh, that's a, that's a cool looking spaceship. Very cool. Very non aerodynamic. Elitza Slaver. Ha! What is this pitiful vessel before us? A garbage scow? Do you want our garbage, fleshy strangers? We are the Elitza. Speak before we decide you would sound better at the bottom of a cobalt mine. Um. You have the privilege of gazing upon our perfection. Do not flatter yourself by thinking you are on our levels. All right. We trade in unwanted lives. Though most of our kind use dregs for menial service, there are certain desires that calls for more varied, capable flesh. All right. Uh, cool. Cool. Uh, goodbye. If you traded your lose weight for a little coin, uh, how about we don't take the slave collar? Your species would be unworthy of our clients <laughs> anyway. Understandable. Have a nice day. <laughs> we found space slavers. We've... Oh boy. Alright. Let's leave the star system and try to head for our... Our, um, the Reeve faction. Let's see if we can save those boys. Alright. So we are still... Oh, the mission's gone. Oh, that's sad. I didn't know what I was supposed to do. So I... I that was sad. Oh, well. Unfortunate. But oh, well. 
Okay. Oh, 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 there's something that way. There's something that way. There's something. Okay. There's something that way. There's something that way. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Do not, do not crash into the star. Do, do not. Oh, my. Oh, God. Well, now we know what happens when you crash into the sun. <sighs> you basically like go around it, but it's like, it's annoying. All right, okay, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. Please slow down. Please, 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 please slow down. Thank you. Thank you, wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. That's great, that's fantastic. Okay, good, good, good. Just, 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 just slowly smash into this thing. Is it like a station? It's a station, isn't it? I think it's a station. Okay. All right. What are we, we What are we dealing with this one? Oh, that's the docking bay. Okay. Let's go that way then. Okay. Carefully, 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 carefully. Okay. Don't smash into it. Okay. Is it like a starport? Okay. There we go. No, it's a broken ship. Huh. Airlock seal connected. EVA one ready to board. Aren't you like? Hold on. Aren't you like heart? I know one of you is heart. No, Alessandra's heart with uh, concussion. Uh, Kirsten's fine. So we're, we're doing it that. First, first of all, we're going to change Malcolm to uh, Lander because Malcolm's a test pilot and I think Malcolm has better controls on the Lander. Anyway, back to calm. Okay, uh, explore. Everything looks quiet. The ship's in bad condition, but I don't see anything hazardous. Okay, let's see what we can find. Yeah. Interesting, the cockpit has a little hologram of two aliens I don't recognize, intermingling with gusto. There's a set of astral coordinates printed on the base. I think we found ourselves an advert for an alien brothel of some sort. <laughs> Adding to our map. Hmm, what else is here? I'm not sure what this is, but it'd be over worth bringing to the lab. Okay, beeping device. Acquired beeping device. I'm sure it's not a bomb. I'm sure it's not going to explode. I'm quite certain. Okay, lab. What is the beeping device? Can't see I understand it, friend. Break it down for parts. I do not like the devices that beeps or device with countdown clock. I can probably melt this down and pass it out. The Reeve would be most interested in this. Really? Really? So we can found the Reeve. We can find the Reeve. What was our uh, mission again? Database? Uh, logbook. No. Um... Huh, the logbook is gone. We need to go to the Reeve again, I think. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. I might try that. I might try that. Okay. Alright. Since we're coming about the end of the stream anyway... Uh... What? No. Um... Map. We can't see the map while we're somewhere, which is kind of sad. Yeah, you can't see the thingy map, the large, large map here, so that's fine, sorry. You know what, we will try to bring this to the Reeve, if they find this interesting, maybe we can figure out like why they hated us suddenly or something. I forgot the mission already, so we're gonna try to see if that's possible. Okay, wh where was that? They were here. Um, there's Proxima Centauri. Which is uh, Elitza situation. Uh, there's Beta Eridani. Uh, we are heading to Beta Eridani. We could directly go there. Yeah, okay, sure. Alright. Okay, what's here on the map? Theta Capricorni. Oh, so someone's coming, someone's coming, someone's coming. Uh, okay, interception. What do you got? Uh, this is another alien ship. Oh, wow. That's really nice. It looks like a solar sail of something. Oh, hello. It's a Miyarko. You, servant, thou art not busy at present. Perfect. Your king has need of thy services. We have the choice. Ah, ah, yes. The choice. The cho I, I, I should actually stop the question right now because... <laughs> Ah, yes, the choice to accept or accept. Oh. 
Splendiferous! Great King Khizret hath decided to host the greatest banquet in this sector. Thou shalt go forth and find the most delicious, rarest food to fill his royal platters. Yes, good. What art thou waiting for? A gilded invitation? <laughs> oh gosh. Um, we shouldn't show up without several code. Okay. Alright. Gosh dang it. We also need to refuel because our fuel situation is looking bad. Alright. Let's uh, go to our resources. Uh, let's go to our EM refinery. We can refuel using this. No, fuel is... fuel is green. Yeah, th this is just that. Hmm. Wait a second, I can go to a shop, can't I? There should be a shop over there. Hold on, hold on. There should be a shop at that, like, yellow thing. Ah, uh, sorry, that... Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. There should be a shop at that uh, purple thing. That purple thing. Slow down, slow down. Head towards that way. Okay, come on, come on. Slowly enter the gravity well. Okay, we're getting close, getting close, getting close. There we go, there we go. We reach the gravity well. There we go. Yeah, there's something here. Is this the house of pleasure? I'm sorry, is this the banquet fit for a miracle? I hope not. I mean, we... Th this does appear to be the banquet fit for a miracle, so how about we don't go there? How about we don't go there? How about we don't? Alright, um... What's at that? What's at this one? We do need to refuel. Uh, we need EM fuel. We need to go to the sun to EM fuel. So let's go to the sun to get some EM fuel. The Theta Capricorn. No, 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 no. Oh, oh, that's them. Okay, never mind. Slow down, slow down. Only one way to deal with bullies. Ah, yes. Punch them. Bully the bullies. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, okay, we need to be, we need to be re really, really cautious, really, really cautious, just, just turn, 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 there we go, there we go. Hmm, we, hold on, hold on, hold on. We can directly smash into the sun to, like, just get us more stuff, right? Hold on. Just slow down, slow down. Okay, good. Turn. Man, turning is so difficult in space. Ain't that the truth? <sighs> oh my gosh. Yeah, let's let's smash through it. I think it does give you some EM. Yeah, there we go. See, y you are gaining EM when you like smash through it. There we go. Almost got all the EM. All right. Now let's try. Let's do another EM run by. <laughs> This is like the stupidest way to collect fuel. Hmm, <laughs> someone has anxiety. Gee, could it be because I've been slamming into the sun repeatedly? <laughs> oh. oh my gosh. Hmm, that was so funny. Okay, that's the Miracle shipyard. There's Beta Eridani. That's, that's close. What's here? Iron, Helium, Xenon? Yeah. And Helium, Fluorine. We could get rare stuff. Rare stuff isn't bad. Yeah, we might go get the rare stuff. Also, I need to stop Idealize. So, that was a little glimpse into... Um, that was a little glimpse into uh, this game. The Long Journey Home. It's quite interesting. It's... Quite good, I would say. The space flight one is really good. The space flight section, I think the yeah, it would have been cool to see like a like a little bit of like ship as like doing a little bit of turning, other than just like an arrow, like the like the asteroid belt sections where you can see the ship. That would be really nice, but I think it's good. It's good as is. Let's see if we can encounter this last group of aliens and 
Come on, we are on, on a more, mostly intercept code. There's the slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. Please. Slow down. Oh, okay, they're orbiting the planet. That's great. Why, why do we get fuel warning? Why did we get fuel warning? That's weird. Come on. Why did we just get fuel warning? Interesting. Oh, because we don't have enough fuel. I was hoping we were going to get to a shop to get fuel, but okay. All right. Anyway, that was the um, that was a brief look into um, the long journey home by uh, Daedalic uh, Studio West. All right. I hope uh, you enjoyed that. Um, And uh, I hope you will check out this game. It is, again, there are like, it's, the universe is randomly generated. You may or may not get like each of the quests every time. Um, there may be different uh, stars with different aliens, sim different from like what you start, what you saw in this video, but yeah. And each of the 10 characters have their own like little um, unique uh, dialogues, um, quests i believe and even some of them have like unique interactions that you know so you really need to play this multiple times to actually get a good grasp of it i think the lander controls are not that great but i think the spaceship controls are really good i i quite enjoy the space flight of like you know like not having any friction and stuff like that that's that's quite interesting i've never done anything like that before so that's like in any game so that's kind of interesting anyway um uh, that was a brief look at the long journey home as part of the game and game and train mixer, not game and train, game and train mixer event, uh, online event um, organized by Giot Institute and Stiflung Spiel Culture. I forgot the full name. Sorry. Uh, thanks to Giot Institute for giving me the opportunity to uh, have like check out these five games that I. Honestly, probably would not have checked out otherwise because there's just so much on my to-do list to play and stuff. So, like, these five games weren't on there. So, like, re real, like, big thanks to them for this. And thanks to them for inviting me to this, um, to be a part of this uh, event. That was, that was really neat. Thank you. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed and um, send those questions and answers to the name applied. I should have like showed that. I I don't know why I didn't. Okay, never mind me. But yeah, uh, send your answers there to find, to potentially win some cool stuff. Uh, thank you for joining in the stream. And if you're interested in my channel, the links are in the description and feel free to check out. Go there and you know, drop by whenever you are ready or interested well take care uh have a good new year uh have a good year in this um this 2021 and i hope everything turns out well for everyone